So I just washed my wig, this is my short wig. I'm gonna wash my long wig back there next. But I watched this one on Saturday, so I'm back to short. I'm not doing anything much crazy to it. I just did a reinstall. It's such an easy on and off wig every day while I get ready to go into my business today. I have, a lot, I have a lot of business to take care of and a lot of people to see and blah, 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 blah. So I'm just making it flat. I did my, my spray tint in here. It actually makes the part more tighter and more close as well, so that's good. And I'm just wearing this out, but I'm moosing the whole hair because I'm, I want that slick look today. So let's see, I've never moosed this hair before. So you're about to see right now. I just wanted to get that a little bit flat before I put the mousse on. So I'm gonna put the mousse on right now. Let's just see how it works. So yesterday I had an audition, so I put the mousse in my. I have the same hair um, twice. I put this mousse in my long hair last night and I was like, oh, I love this. So hopefully it does the same effect. Like, I really don't know what it's going to give. I'm just winging it. Now, the hair is freshly washed, like I said. Um, I did a silicone shampoo deep conditioner. And of course, I let it air dry. So let's see what this hair is going to give when I put the mousse in it. I really don't know, but I'm gonna try it. Everything's about trying these days. If it works, it works. If it don't work, switch it up. And this is, I love this mousse. Fabric. This is a loaded body with coconut and shea oils. Wrap me foaming mousse. I love this mousse, actually. I don't know, my pump is broke, as you can see, but another day. All right, so let's just keep, make sure I'm getting the ends, too. So I definitely make sure I get the ends. Last night, I didn't put a whole bunch in the long hair just because I was seeing it out uh, and I had to wash it because the the front, the closure on that one is crusty. So I didn't really like, you know, I didn't really um, put a lot in. I just was like, oh, but I, the little bit that I put in, I like. So this time, I'm going to really try to style this as best as I can here. But I know I don't want any dry pieces, like I don't want any frizz or anything like that. Maybe I should have put oil in for this, I don't know. Maybe when it dries, I'll put the oil. Let's just see, let's see. I'm in the phase of trying it and let's see. If it works, it works. If it doesn't work, gotta move on. I don't know if I wanna put it up there necessarily because I don't know if I want that part to be wavy. Like, you know what I'm saying? I do overall want like a wet and wavy look for today. It is spring in New York, so why not? So I am thinking I'm getting that wet look that I'm trying to go for today. I'm so nervous. Always do the same corny hairstyle. Like I just be wanting my hair every day. I don't do anything fun. And I'm trying to be fun. Let's do some... Let's, oh, maybe I should have put it in sections, right? I should do like this, like one section at a time. And then go like that, probably. Yeah, I probably should do that. But I did it. So. I don't know. What y'all think? Am I doing this right? How would y'all style this hair? Let me know. For me, I'm very basic. That's why I normally have the same hairstyle every day. Because I don't want to get crazy in my hair. To be honest. Like, I just. Simple and. So I figure while this air dries, I can get dressed and do my makeup and stuff like that. Alright, I think I'm good on the side flaps, I hope. I really do hope. So I'm actually not sure if I do like it. It might be too wet looking. I don't know if that makes sense, but you know, I, I'm very particular about my hair, weave, wig, natural, all of it, and braids, don't matter. I have to have it to look nice to my standard. And me doing this hairstyle right now, I just feel like, I don't know if I like it. I don't, I don't know what, what it's going to give. Is it going to be that wet look? Like, again, I keep saying it over and over because there is a look that... The girlies can achieve 
with a wet look and I'm I think that's what I'm trying to go for for today I just don't think I don't know if this hair texture is the right hair texture for it you get what I'm saying that's the thing I'm thinking about or considering rather Okay, so up here is not. So that's going to be the problem. Now I'm seeing what's going on here. It needs to start from the root. I see what's going on here. All right. I added some more on the top. I'm feeling like I want to, like, like brush my hair as it's wet. Like, meaning wet the brush and brush my hair. I'm, I'm hoping that's, like, something that'll work. Let me see. I just don't want it to dry first. Like I want it to dry hard a little bit. That makes any sense. See the ends. It's the ends for me. I don't know. Let's just try. I do see where I need to add more mousse. Definitely these ends. But see, something's happening here. You see what I'm saying? Something's happening here. Something that I like is 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 happening here. I'm not sure what I just did here, but I feel like I like something here. So let me just add some more moves to the ends over here. I feel like these, I feel like this end is not in here. Or maybe I should have brushed the hair wet first and then added the mousse. I don't know. This ain't my real natural hair texture. I don't know. I don't know. I don't even know what's left in my hair. All right. Add it to the brown end for this side. Mm. I think I might like what's happening here, though. I will. I will keep saying that. I think I do. I think I do. I hope. I'm gonna give it another brush through, and hopefully, I can move on from this hair. Alright, ready, let's see. Thank you. 